Let's talk about my three favorite time-saving tricks in PowerPoint. The first is to pin your files. Anything that you're working on, when you go to the File tab, there is a thumbtack. Click the thumbtack and it pins your file there for the duration until you remove it. You can right click to remove any files. And this works in PowerPoint, in Word, and in Excel. But I find it an easy, quick way to find the files that I'm working with consistently. If I'm doing an annual report and I know I'm going to need that file over and over and over again, I pin it to my file tab. So look for the thumbtacks. That's my first tip. So my second time-saving tip is to set up your quick access toolbar. And your quick access toolbar lives above that file tab. There's about three buttons on it by default. You can click any tool on your ribbon and choose add to quick access toolbar and that will populate tools onto your quick access toolbar. If you need to reorder them, click the little arrow that's at the right hand end of the quick access toolbar and choose more commands. You can add more commands that are not on the ribbon and you can also reorder the things that you've added. But the most important thing is to click the arrow and choose show below the ribbon. That gives you a lot more space to add a lot more tools and it also makes it closer to your workspace. So as you're developing muscle memory, you also have to travel your mouse a little less far. So that's my second time-saving tip. Use your quick access toolbar to use your frequently accessed tools and place them close to your workspace. So my third time-saving tip is to make sure that your template is built correctly. I specialize in building PowerPoint templates for corporations, and I can't tell you how many I see that are just completely and utterly broken. The biggest tip I can give you there is to ensure that your corporate branding colors are built into the template. This can save you so much time because your, your colors are just right there in every color picker throughout PowerPoint. You can also set up your colors in Word and in Excel templates, and I suggest that you do so. The way I look at it is, if I can save you 10 minutes a day from having to, you know, scramble around and try to find your colors, then I've saved you about an hour every week. And if I've saved you an hour every week, then over the course of a year, I have saved you a whole week and maybe even more. Now, multiply that by every person in your organization. You see what a time suck a badly built template can be? Save yourself the trouble, make sure your template's built correctly by someone who can build a template and make sure those colors are built in correctly. So those are my three time-saving tips. Pin your files, set up your quick access toolbar, and make sure your template is built correctly.